This is an RTV6 update working for you. Hello, I'm Meredith Barrick, and these are your latest headlines from the RTV6 newsroom. We're learning more about the upcoming memorial service for legendary Indiana Senator Birch Bayh. We first told you over the weekend the service will be at noon on May 1st in the South Atrium of the State House. Today, a long list of speakers for Senator Bayh's remembrance was announced. They will include Governor Holcomb, Congressman Andre Carson, and former Governor and current Purdue President Mitch Daniels. Bai will be eulogized by his sons, former Governor and Senator Evan Bai and Indianapolis attorney Christopher Bai. Birch Bai died at the age of 91 back on March 14th. Our Hiring Hoosiers initiative is all about connecting you with jobs, and this week we're looking ahead to the jobs of the future. Plastic pollution could propel a new era of jobs. A Purdue lab is working on turning discarded plastics into fuel to power your vehicle, lawnmower, or even aircraft. Purdue researchers point to a study which shows a majority of plastics end up in landfills or just as litter. They believe this idea could create many jobs based on the extent of the global pollution problem. The group is still working on the idea, but hopes to have it on the market in the next five years. For more information on this idea and jobs of the future, you can head on over to HiringHoosiers.com. Todd. It's going to be a pretty unsettled weather pattern here over the course of the next 36 to 48 hours with numerous opportunities for showers. Now, it's not going to be raining at all times. There's a lot of dry hours mixed in, but you probably want to have the umbrella handy. Some showers move through this evening across the area. Then as we head into the overnight hours, as the warm front continues to work through, additional showers will greet you for your Thursday morning commute and then throughout the day tomorrow. We'll just continue to deal with these scattered showers off and on and maybe even a little bit more in the way of steady rainfall as we enter Friday morning. It's not until probably early morning on Friday that we get rid of the clouds and then eventually the sunshine returns, setting us up for a beautiful Friday afternoon. But until then, again, umbrellas will be needed across the area. Temperature wise will be in the mid to upper 60s as we get into your Thursday afternoon. Todd, thank you for more weather and stories you need to know. Download the RTV6 mobile app. Thanks for joining us.